Hello, and welcome back to Pop and Sodas. I'm Derek, and this is Thanksgiving week. We are closing out our Thanksgiving-themed soda week with Reading Soda Works Cran Raspberry Soda. Finding Thanksgiving-themed flavors can be a little tough sometimes, and I like cranberry sauce at my Thanksgiving, and here we go, Cran Raspberry Soda. Um, I'm also from the Philadelphia area, so Reading, Pennsylvania is not too far from there. Redding has been around for a long time. 1921 is when they got started, and they were bought out fairly recently in 2015. So they are under new ownership, and they are from Redding, Pennsylvania. They have 17 different regular draft craft sodas. They sell in relatively normal sizes, like your 12-ounce bottles and fountain, but you can also buy all of their sodas in a pre-mixed 5-gallon keg, which is pretty cool if you've ever seen something like that. It's pretty fun. They use a slow carbonation process, which is different than most sodas. Most use a flash carbonation process, so your Cokes and Pepsis, things like that. Slow carbonation processes are supposed to generate smaller bubbles to have a smoother taste to it, smoother experience, and it's supposed to stay carbonated a little bit longer as well. So not too many sodas still use a slow carbonation process, but they do here at Redding, which is pretty neat. They also have a line of sodas called Canafiz, which are CBD-infused sodas. Don't have one of those right now, haven't tried one of those, but it is interesting. If that's up your alley, you can check that out. Go to their website, and you can see a lot more information on their Canafiz line of sodas. But today we're trying Redding Draft's Cran Raspberry Soda. Let's go ahead and pop this soda. So you can see that it's very bubbly, but the fizz goes down fairly fast. Mm, it's got a very nice, sweet, kind of fruity flavor, uh, fruity smell to it. I do that a lot. Very, very nice. Well, here you go. Redding Draft's Cran Raspberry Soda. Cheers. Yeah, that's really quite nice. It's a very light, fruity, sweet flavor. Maybe just a tad bit syrupy. It kind of reminds me of when you would do like syrup in an Italian ice or something like that, you know, if you've ever had Rita's or something. The cranberry isn't overpowering. It is definitely more of a raspberry flavor than a cranberry flavor, but I really like it. It's light, it's sweet, it's colorful, it's um, not overbearing in any way. I could really knock these out. Probably more of a summer drink though. It's just a good solid cranberry raspberry soda. So I'm going to go ahead and give this one an 8 out of 10. Pretty good week here for Thanksgiving week. Three good sodas. I would recommend all three of the sodas that we tried this week. Whereas like last week when we did the root beer week, uh, it would be hard to recommend any of those. Definitely two of them I wouldn't. So there you have it. I'm Derek. This has been Poppin' Sodas. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you next time.